Hello everyone and welcome back to another Ranch Sim video. I know it has been a while, life has been kind of crazy, switching jobs, all kinds of stuff, but in this video I'm going to show you how to make cheese and I'm going to show you different things that give it a better, I'm not going to say quality, but value. And first off, these are, I have two milk machines. I have one that's cow's milk and one that's goat's milk. Currently they're both full. I was not expecting that. But to use these, you have this little thing right here on the side. And you would just attach that to whichever animal that you're going to milk. And it will automatically pump. If you're going to use a bucket, I think I have one in the side over here. Yes. If you use a bucket, let me go find the cow. See how the green is there? So press E to install, and then hold E to start milking. And then you have to press like D, A, D, A, and so forth to milk. And then whenever it's finished milking, the cow will actually be upset because she doesn't have any more milk. Like that, right? So press E to stop milking, and now I can pick up that bucket. And I've got a full bucket of milk as well. So I'm going to take this one to the house first because that's where I keep all of my other stuff for making cheese. And I'm just going to drop it on the floor and I'm going to go get the other tank as well. So it looks kind of crazy. Got all kinds of uh, stuff in here for making cheese. It does bring in a good bit of money, but I will definitely say... The video that I showed earlier about how to make the sausages is how I've made most of my money. If I press escape here, my household balance is 67374 I know there are probably other people out there that have more money than me, but I don't play it a whole lot. I mean, I work full time too. So this is just kind of my hobby. And... I would love to have my own ranch someday, so I just enjoy the game. But I'm gonna go ahead and take this one in here too. Just set it down. I'm gonna use the bucket first though. And so press E to add. That is all the milk from that bucket. For some reason the bottom of it disappeared. And then I'm actually going to take an egg and put it in there as well. And I'm going to start with the white mold. I think these are both uh, mold for cow cheese. But I'm going to add some white mold in there too. And then, let's see if I can put it back on the counter. Yeah. Alright, and then just press E to start cooking. It's already at 4%. goes up pretty fast. But that's what I'm going to do for the rest of these as well. Just add a bunch of milk. There's one left in there for that. I'm gonna use the rest of this white mold. It doesn't matter which order you put the mold or the eggs in there because it works either way. So that's the last of those four and then we'll start with the blue. The blue costs a lot of money but your cheese sells for more as well. So egg one, egg two, egg three, egg four, and egg five. And then I'm going to get all of these cooking. This one just finished, so I'm going to press E to take the product. And then over here, there are... I don't want to call them drying racks, because that's what, not what they're doing. They're kind of like fermenting, I guess. Um, but you just set it on the rack. This is the part that takes the longest. And I'm just going to leave it there to do as it will. And let's get this last one made. Add some mold, add an egg, and get it cooking. Now the rest of these are done too. This is my blue mold. I'm going to put it over here on this side. Back and forth until we've got them all on the racks over here. There's also a, um, like if you don't have a house built to set all this stuff up in, there is like a little cabinet that you can build for cheeses. And it works just as well as the one in the house. 
this is actually the second house that me and my boyfriend, we play this together, have built. And I think we built this same house the first time, but it was, like, way over there. And we were like, we have to run so far to get to the house every night. And we just didn't want to do that, so we built one closer. And this is what we have now. It's pretty cute. Doesn't have a whole lot of functionality. It would be cool if it did. Um, but yeah. I will get back with you when these are done. And you can see how much they sell for. Alright, now that I have returned my milk bucket, I'm actually going to show you how this works now. So I take this and I just hook it on right there. And I haven't milked Bailey yet, I have two milking cows, and so it's just going to fill up to 14. Apparently she's got 14 gallons of milk in her. And then you can take it off and she's free to roam again and just put it back on. Super simple. Shadowmir, is your tail okay? Yes. Having the advanced mane and tails is the funniest thing sometimes, because they just do what they want. Look at that crinkly hair. Crystal is mine, Shadowmir, where'd she go? Is my boyfriend's. Maybe later I'll make a video about how training horses goes. It's not like legit training, it's just riding them around in a circle and jumping over some jumps. But I know that horses are not the easiest thing to come by, so it's a possibility.
Okay, so at this point in time, the goat cheese that I made has finished. All of those just have egg in them, they don't have any mold, but I'm still waiting on the cow's milk cheese to finish. So I will continue to wait and let you know when they're done, and we can take them all to one of the stores and sell them and you can see how much they go for. Yes, it looks like they are almost done. This one's at like 67 and 66%, but I'm going to go ahead and start getting some coolers to get these in coolers and ready to go. And as you can tell, looking at the cooler, it tells you this is goat cheese with egg in it, and I currently have six of them in the cooler. I will continue adding more in the meantime. But I'll try to keep them separated like this. Um, it should tell you whenever you go to sell them, like, the exact same description as well. Alright, so this cooler has all five of the cow cheeses that have the egg and the white mold. I don't know why it separated them by four and one, but it's the five with the white mold. And we're still waiting on the cow cheese with the blue mold. Currently at 73 and 72 percent. The girls, may be ready to milk again. the girls may be ready to milk again today, too. Alright, while you're here, Bridget first. Up to 17. The goats produce less milk than the cows, obviously. Um, There you are. Oh, because I hooked up you up to the cow one. Sorry, my mistake. We need this one. There you go, Lupe. Uh, honestly, I can't tell you why the goat's named Lupe. That was my boyfriend's choice. 
I think I named the other one Bridget. Hello, Shadowmere. Thank you for standing inside of me. Alright. Now, who's this? Betty. Come on, Betty. We milked you with the bucket yesterday. But this time, you're gonna get the milk machine. Alright, we're up to 28. That was another 14 in there. And then... Come on, Miss Bailey. Are you stuck? There you go. Your turn. Bam. And we're full again. So, I can make cheese all the time, honestly. Like, almost every day in this game. And I only have two cows. And this full bucket fills up every single one of these. See? And then if I place it down, now it's empty. Which is why I have six of them. Get the egg in. And then I can put the mold in some until we run out of the mold. And then cook them. How are you doing? 80%? Time to keep waiting. <laughs> also, if you saw my last video, you probably heard this noise. That's because these are the beehives where we have our bees, and we have a good bit of them. Though, it doesn't... Oh, it's at 100. Just kidding. I was like, it doesn't look like they're producing. Yeah, they're producing. Oh. Um. that and turn it on. That's gonna fill up pretty quickly. Wait, was that one already full? That one's empty. I guess you could call that a mini tutorial on how bees work. To get them in the hive, you just take one of the um, hive sheets. I think there's some empty ones on top of the truck. Like this. Um, to a beehive that's in a tree. Oh look. There's already one in here that needs to be sold full of honey. So we'll move bees up there too. There we are. Let's go check on that cheese. We're at 90% though. So I am going to go take a break and let these do their magic. Alright, it looks like our blue mold cheese is finally done. So I'm going to go ahead and go get 
this little thing to put those in. So egg and blue mold, two of those in there. And then these are still around 60%. Those are around 15. This is the rest of the blue mold. And these are just with egg, I believe. Or maybe not even have egg in them. I'm not sure. I could go back and see, but we'll figure it out eventually. Or I will. But it is in the middle of the night. So I'm going to go ahead and put these in the truck. But then I will have my character sleep and we can take all of that to the store in the morning. And we're up. I would say bright and early, but it is close to 8 a.m. in the game. That's not how that's supposed to work. Hello. There we go. These don't do a whole lot overnight. So I'm going to leave them here for now. I'll go ahead and take this stuff to the store. What store shall we go to? I don't know if I can sell honey to the um, burger shop. So I'm going to go there first and try it. And then... If we can't sell the honey there, too, I'll go up the street to the general store. That tree is really close right there. Oh no, back up a little. And I need room to be able to get out of the truck. Work. Okay, that should all be in the zone. To sell... You can sell the honey. So I know it said 7.5 on the little barrels, but it's considered 75 when you take them to the store. I have four of the little barrels on the top of the truck. Um, it sells for $4 each. 300 total each because four times 75 um the goat cheese with just egg in it i have 10 of them they're selling for 60 each 600 the this one says a cow cheese with egg in white mold sells for 110 and here's the other four 440 and then this is two of the cow cheese with egg and blue mold and they're 175 each in 350. So I'm just gonna go ahead and sell all of those. That's another 2700. And it's all gone. But that is how to make cheese, what it sells for. Um, I know I did cheese with additives. You can make the cheese without putting eggs or mold in it. It doesn't sell for as much as what you just saw. There's a deer there. Just randomly dead. We'll sell that later. I have some others uh, with just the wild meat in them. And a tree that was cut down, but not... I don't know. Anyways. That's how to make cheese. That's what cheese with additive sells for. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments section. And if there's anything else you want to know about the game, please let me know that as well. Um, like and subscribe if you like the content. I appreciate you for watching, and have a great day, night, evening, whatever it is for you. Bye.